good morning welcome to my channel we are driving on highway 17 in ontario between uh, south st marie and wawa right now and as you can see it's not the best of roads today and it's pretty windy up here as soon as we hit an open spot the uh, the wind is coming across the lake they're so strong that almost blows me over and uh, I saw probably about five six feet high waves coming in on that shore there that's how windy it is that's uh, pretty windy there but hey what can you do just take her easy and try to get some miles underneath right we'll see how far we can make it today but Right now it's a little bit better again there for a little while even the visibility was pretty poor there but right now the visibility is a little bit better than it was but hey what can you do right at least we're rolling at least the highway is not shut down or not too many people on the road today so at least they're not bothering me right i don't know what we got going on up here but we got something going on like somebody has lost something or they're doing something ah oh, looks like they're just taking a leak up here that's what it looks like <coughs> so they couldn't wait any longer <laughs> oh, they just make it dangerous for on the road you know like they couldn't pull over on one of these pullover areas you know goes sometimes now you tell me if you can see where am I supposed to be whereabouts because I only see white stuff and probably about five six feet uh, high edges right here look at that here on the right here look at them high snow banks and this is a two-lane highway here you know, this car is just about stopping here do that I saw a uh, boys and truck in the ditch there a while back ago I didn't have time to turn the camera on but it was the same thing he uh, I guess he lost sight of the road and uh, he hit uh, he hit the he hit the shoulder here and uh, the snowbank caught him so he was sitting right against up the snowbank there so I already saw the tow truck on his way over there too, so he's got the tow truck on its way. I hope he didn't do too much damage though. Because as you can see, this is dangerous, you know. Now this is what you call a whiteout situation. I guarantee you this is not fun. Alrighty, here we go. We are in Wawa, Ontario and uh, I got lots of snow again. Oh yeah. <clears throat> Everything is covered in snow. Look at that. My fuel cap is not even visible. So I grabbed the hammer. We're going to do a circle check here again. And uh, look at them. Look at them rims. How much snow we got in there. This is underneath my trailer. That's my landing gear. Yep. <clears throat> Let's clear my lights. Holy moly! Look at all them snow. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna clear some snow off and then uh, gonna grab me a bite to eat. And I wanted to ask all of you guys, do you think that trucking is an easy job? Because I certainly don't think so. Especially in conditions like these, you know. This uh, certainly isn't an easy job, you know. And it's also dangerous, you know. There we go. Tires are all good. All right. Well, let's take a look at the back. I am pretty sure 
there is going to be a lot of snow in the back. Matter of fact, that's how I took a look. No, that ain't supposed to be like that. Let's take this away. Oh, look at that. We got lights again. Oh. Yeah, I don't know if you're going to be able to see it up there, but uh, we got a cop up there. And what he's doing up there, he's shutting the highway down. Yep, and the highway is closed going east. I don't know if it's going to be closed going uh, westbound from here, but I don't see, I didn't see any signs of it. Because usually if that's the case, they would have uh, cops further down the road there. And I don't see no flashing lights up there, so. Alright. Clear all of this stuff out of here. Here we go. Look at all that snow come down. <laughs> Just about hit me. There we go, we got a big pile. Look at that. There we go. Yeah, I like to clear clear the snow off of here, you know. So that way my lights are visible again. People driving behind me can see my lights, you know. So here we go. Uh, that side covered. Do this side here, and then I'm gonna go grab me a bite to eat, and we'll see if we can continue on driving today. You know. There we go. Well, I don't blame them for high uh, closing the highway. You know, it's it was very very dangerous. It was pretty much whiteout conditions up there, you know, so you couldn't you couldn't see anything. So let's go do that, and then we'll be back later. Well, I have officially stopped for the day. <clears throat> Excuse me, my throat is still killing me, but I have stopped at the uh, Fly and J over at uh, Cheyenne, Ontario. I think they call it. It's probably about 40 kilometers before Thunder Bay, Ontario. If I'm going westbound, and uh, yeah, so I'll probably get me something to eat here soon and uh, go to bed pretty soon, I think, because I'm not, I don't feel bad, but my throat is just killing me. So uh, I think I'm gonna have me some soup for dinner. I still have some soup left in the truck, so probably gonna warm me up some soup and then uh, add it up some of these videos and hey. Now we'll be going to bed and hopefully tomorrow will be a good day again. Yeah, it's not been a horrible day today, but yeah, the, the weather wasn't very good, but yeah, what can you do? It's winter, right? Deal with it, suck it up, I guess, and just hope you stay safe, right? Which we did. We haven't had any accident. We haven't hit the ditch, nothing like that. We haven't gotten stuck. It's all good. So uh, I guess with that, we shall see you tomorrow at 5 a.m.